So we're back in Para Para, and I have paid off the incline thingy. It was really expensive in my own time, on my own account. You can just imagine how small my house is going to be because I am not doing any of the mortgage. I'm not paying it ever. Because every time I save money, I'm putting it towards making our village great. Is it a village? It's an island. So I'm making the island great, which is good because we all get to experience it. But I don't know how we're gonna get people to move in. Like, we don't have any other houses and they're not giving me the option to build any. So I'm just wondering, are we gonna be able to build new homes for new people or is that it? Can we only have like five other residents? I'm hoping not, because I want it to be a bit more lively, you know? I mean, I love the residents we have, but we'll see, we'll see. We've got the campsite now as well. That's also happened, so that's really, really good and I'm very excited to go and check out what it means what it does, and also Mabel, Mabel's shop should be ready soon. I'd imagine it's already ready. I mean, I haven't really played it because I've been in work. Um, yeah, been doing long shifts in the hospital, so. Busy times, busy, 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 yeah. Oh, I don't know if any of you know, but I am, I'm a nurse, so that is why I post randomly at random different, Oh, hello, Isabel, at randomly different times. At random different times. <laughs> okay, Isabel, hi there, everyone. Right now, on Para Para, it's 2.10pm on Wednesday, April 22nd, 2020. Now, for today's announcement, everyone, I'm pleased to inform you that the Abel Sisters Tailor Shop has opened on Para Para. We can buy clothes now. The tailor shop will have all the fashion items you'd expect, as well as a custom design gallery. This is a great chance for everyone to enjoy new styles and maybe start our own para para trends. I like the sound of that. <laughs> also, ooh. oh, of course, yeah, that's what we were talking about. Did you know that para para is home to a new campsite? The campsite is a place for visitors to experience the beauty of our island and the kindness of its residents. Oh. So cute. I can't think of anything more fitting for Para Para. I'm sure we'll get plenty of visitors, so take a moment to wander over and spread that island charm. We're gonna go see is there someone there? And of course, we'll be holding a special ceremony to celebrate the happy news. I don't like these ceremonies, they're so boring. If you are interested in participating and have the time, please check in with Tom Nook at Resident Services. We'll do that. That's all for today, have fun out there. I'll check in with them because I want to build some more stuff. But, we're not holding ceremony. They bore me. I didn't like the last one. I mean, it was okay, but like, once isn't enough. Oh yeah, this is what we look like. Love it. Ha, oh, we are so cool. Let's open it. Open the stuff. What are these? We, well, we'll put them in our house because we don't want them. We don't, we don't need these. I like that music. I don't even know that's a tune to be honest, but oh yeah, I like our house. I forgot about this. Do, 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 do. I'm very excited about all of this. I don't know why. Oh, we've got we've got a tarantula. We can go sell it. Let's go, Charlotte. Um, do we have a tape recorder? I don't think we do, do we? So I'm buying all these tapes and I don't I have a tape recorder. Is it a tape? What is it? Whatever. Whatever that is, I don't have one. I don't have one to play it, so let's put it in storage. Is there anything else in our storage that we can sell? Anything for a bit of money? Money, money, money. No. Nope. Got loads of these. <laughs> and we can't do anything with them. It's fine though. I like it. It looks good. Shall we take that out? Because we can always. <gasps> Let's take this because we can give it to someone if they want a present. And we've got two of them, so we don't need two of them. Um, we'll give someone a box of tissues because I don't need that one. That's nice. Jukebox. I like the jukebox. I'm going to keep it. Shall we give someone some clothes? Rubber apron. Ooh, that's not nice. <laughs> that's pretty ugly. Trench coat. Mmm. Tweed vest, we can give that to someone maybe. We'll give our dress to someone if they want it. Um, Goldie would look cute in a strawberry dress, let's take that. Okay, let's go. I don't know what tune, is that the tune? <laughs> I don't think it's the tune, I don't know what I'm having. Okay, let's go have a look. We were gonna go check stuff out. Let's go see if it, hey, it's Patty, she's doing yoga? Hey Patty, what are you up to? Oh my gosh, oh, I should posh. Oh my gosh, Blinky. Finally I get to chat with you. I've um I've legit missed you a lot. Aww. What's up? Do you want to practice being pop stars together? Not really. <laughs> oh my gosh, my heart's kabooming right out of my chest. 
It's that, is that over the top? I don't care. Know why? Because we've got a tailor shop now. Fab. I'm this island's fashion icon and that's a responsibility, my trendy bestie. I need a shop where I can take my time choosing clothes that will make you look at me and say pop star. I'm going to be hanging around that store so much they might just hire me. How now? Okay, I'm fed up of talking to you. <laughs> You are delusion. Oh, it's Ron. Hello, my darling. Oh, what are you wearing? Oh, no. I gave him that top, but it doesn't suit him. Uh, I can't catch anything. Come talk to me. Darling. Oh, he's got an accent. Oh, it's got an Australian accent. It's an Australian accent. I think these scaredy fish are just afraid of my huge bulging muscles, Ace. Come on. Talk to me, Rod. Need something, Ace? Oh. Eric left something in my house when he came over for a visit. Sending it by mail is a no-go, but I'm too busy to run over and return it. He probably thinks he lost it and is worried sick. What should I do? I'll return it. Really? Really? That's not, that's not uh, in Australia. Really? I can't do really. What's the word really in an Australian accent? Really? You're a lifesaver, Blanky. <laughs> well then, please give this to Eric. My accent doesn't sound very good, does it? <laughs> no, I'm starting to... No, it's not working. Sorry to rush you, but could you take care of that today? Yes, I can. No, it's not. <laughs> oh, well. <laughs> it is what it is. <laughs> oh, I, I actually enjoy doing these accents just because of the fails. The accent fails. Okay, Eric, that's not your house, that's Rod's house. Where are you, babe? Eric, come speak to me. I've got a prezi of yours. Can you imagine if he's making him give him something really horrible? And I'm just like, yeah, I'll do it. Oh, he's making stuff. Come on, talk to me. Blanky! Um, watch your step, okay? What are you doing? I'm making an orange end table. Oh, he's gonna give me the recipe. Plans, check it out. No, it's not, it's not the accent. Check it out. Plans for an orange end table. I can teach you if you want. Yeah, teach me. Teach me, babe. Leave it to me. I got it all scribbled down right here, so just read this. If I can make it, then I bet you could do it. No time, child. I'm here. I've got something to give you. Delivery time. Delivery for me. Oh, look. I kind of want to open it, but I'm not going to, because that's really mean, and it belongs to Eric. Huh? I left something behind. What is it? My business suit coat. He's making... Rod's making everyone look as posh as him. He's got a suit and tie on, and now he's giving Eric a suit coat. No, no, don't wear it. Don't you dare wear it. Oh, thank goodness. Blanky, hey, thanks for the delivery. Say hi to Rod for me. Oh, he's giving me something. Oh, no, we already have pears. I got really excited then. I've already, we already have pears. Eric. Let's just talk. Wednesday always makes me miss that TV show. Shrimp Tempura Station. That sounds awful. <laughs> that doesn't sound good. Oh, Eric, you watch some weird things. <laughs> All right, let's go find, let's go find Rodney. Rodney, the Australian, who has a very, very strange accent because of Christina. Hey. Oh, yeah, that's, thanks for returning the stuff, Eric lost. So did Eric happen to say anything nice? Come to think of it. He didn't even realize I'd left it in my place, huh? Well, thank you for returning it. That's one problem solved. Here you go, have some stuff, because you're, you're, you're just, you know. To be fair, he's my friend. I love him. Rod is my buddy. Let's see, what can we give him? We can give him a yucca. What was a yucca? I can't, oh, it's a plant, isn't it? A rattan wardrobe, a tissue box, strawberry dress, a dress, tweed vest. No, he wouldn't suit tweed vest. What's this one? A hand cart. No. That's too girly for him. Let's give him a yucca. Here, have a yucca. It's a plant, isn't it? So it'll look good. Wow, it's a yucca. Are you sure? Wow, that's very muscular of you. What? I can't, I can't, I can't wait to show this off. I was also looking for an excuse to move my stuff around. Do you want these 682, specifically 682 bells? <laughs> what? <laughs> Why not round it? Why not give me 700? I don't get it. Okay. You strange boy. Oh, he's smiling at me. Look at him. He's so cute. Let's, let's reaction at him. How do we reaction? No. Look at me, dude. Oh, you so cute. Oh, Rod, you're lovely. Let's go check out. No, why am I still doing the accent? Let's go check out the Able Sisters. <laughs> oh, that was funny. Can you imagine if I'm just walking around with my friends and then suddenly I start talking like this? 
Oh, that's so creepy. What is that? Oh, I like the dress. Oh, oh, sorry. Oh, hey, it's the great, it's the great spot finder, Blanky. Thanks for picking this fantastic location for us. We decided to put down our roots here on Para Para. Keep selling our clothes and accessories. Here, <laughs> let me give you a quick tour of our shop. Okay, so when you first walk in, you'll find out find our recommended items right there, front and centre. We change this up every single day, you know, to keep things fresh. Then over the left, you'll find our mannequins. They're dressed up in whatever seasonal outfits we're into. We change them from time to time rather than daily. Still, we hope you'll be inspired. And of course, if you see something on the mannequins you love, you're more than welcome to buy it. Which brings us back to, here you find custom designs brought in by customers. Love to display your designs, of course. And if you want any of these designs, they're yours for free. Speaking of custom designs, next to the wall displays, you'll find our custom design portal. You can use that kiosk to order designs from creators all over the world and share your own. Last thing I want to tell you is the fitting room. About the fitting room, it's on the right side of the shop in the back. This is where you can go to try on anything that's available for sale that day, including all the colour variants. Ah! Our fitting dis display space, our display, <laughs> oh no, oh no. <laughs> our display, display, it's a tongue twister. Our display space is limited, so the fitting room is also the place to check out items we couldn't put out. Yeah, the fitting room is really great, and it's a terrific way to see how an outfit is coming together. I think that's everything. Wow, I guess I get kind of chatty when I'm talking about the shop. We're open every day from 9 to 9 p.m. Yes, that's a great time. Only 9 p.m. is a bit early to close. I hope I'll be seeing you in here lots. Right, well, I want this because this is really cute. Yes. What? That's well expensive. I'll buy it. But it's well expensive. Oh my gosh, I love all of these. I want that one. And I want the one above it. And I want this. Oh, I don't want that one. I don't. Let's see what this looks like. Bottom row. Someone. Oh, these are designs. They're really good designs. Wow. Look at these leopard shoes. Leopard pumps. Wow, everything's so expensive in here. I really like them. I like this outfit. Can you buy the whole outfit? Oh, you have to buy it. How, how long do they leave it at the shop, did she say? Let's see what's in here. Fitting room. Yeah, let's go have a look. Let's go check it out. Let's go see what it look like. Oh, they have loads of different colours. Oh, I like that one. That one would look... <gasps> oh my gosh. This is lovely. Oh my gosh. I want the red one. No, no, no. Oh, I thought I was paying for it. I didn't have the money. I don't have money for that. Oh, I like this. Oh, I like it all. Oh, what, what am I going to do? I like all of these things when I don't have the money for it. Ah! <laughs> oh well. So, let's see. How much... Oh, I like these. Oh, I like that. That's really cute. I want the black ones. No, I like the black ones. Um, I don't like that. That's just weird. This thing. No, I don't like it. It's scary. Um, let's have a look. Okay, so I would want this. And I would also want that. And the shorts. I can't afford them. <laughs> I want it all. I can't. Can I at least afford the glasses? Let's unselect everything. And only select the glasses. Can I afford... The can't even afford the glasses. Wow. Who would have thought that my game life would be the same as my real life? <laughs> okay, let's go. Did we buy anything? Oh, we bought a kimono. Cool. But we'll wear that another time because we look good right now. We're good. We're rocking the leaf. It's fine. We didn't need your outfits. We designed and built our own from a pile of weeds. <laughs> Let's go check out the, uh... oh, the incline. Let's go check out the incline. Let's go see if we can walk up. Oh, there's the guy who fishes. Fishy man. Do we have any fish to give him? We can sell him some fish if he wants. Hi, dude. <laughs> CJ, here, coming at you. Um, well, it's more like standing by you, I guess. Newt, newt. Anyway, ever since I started doing my sea sports challenges, I've been trending in a huge way. It's so slick. Each time someone navigates a challenge, I offered to buy up the fish. I even paid premium. I only t I don't know why I'm shouting for his voice, but you know what? It sounds right, because he's so obsessed with selfies and stuff, and he's going to talk like this. I only offer to buy after a challenge, though. Keeps it interesting. Newark. But everyone's abroad. 
What? Everyone's abroad? Oh, everyone's abroad! <laughs> I was like, no one's abroad right now. No one's abroad, mate. Everyone's aboard. I get way, way fresh fish for my live stream. <laughs> and the lucky angler gets showered in bells. So, how about a challenge, sea sports style, right now? Win and I'll make it ring and talk you up on my stream. He's, my partner's into making slick collectibles if you want one. He's so talented. Nyuk, nyuk. Nah, not right now. Cool though, but no. He's gonna be here till 5 a.m. or 5 a.m.? That's a weird time to be here. Oh, it's done. Oh, Goldie, she, Goldie's treating it like it's her own personal garden. Look, it's so cute. Oh, Goldie, you're so flipping cute, man. I love you. I love you, Goldie. Come talk to me. Oh, hello. Oh, well, hello, wolf. I want to chat. I try to be a good listener. You can talk to me anytime, wolf. That was supposed to be Welsh, but I don't know. <laughs> Come and talk to me, Goldie. What's on your mind, wolf? Let's talk. This clear weather is perfect for spotting meteors. Just imagine actually seeing shooting stars. Oh, that's been cute. You are so cute. All right, let's go. I can pick that up, but I won't because we're the one other stuff right now. Let's go to the campsite, and then we're gonna talk to Tom Nook. See if we can build some houses. Ooh, butterfly. That's all right though. We, we got that one. We got one, one before. We got that one before. Yep. Let's go, let's go, let's go. <gasps> cool! Campsite. Who's in? I'm so happy. Let's see. Please be camera frog. Oh, it's a frog, but it's not camera frog. <laughs> bon oh, he's Italian. Buongiorno. The name is Hawk. <laughs> Glad to see I am the first one using this campsite. Ow, my leg is hurting me. I've got a cramp. <laughs> And you live on this island, don't you? And now I sound a bit Maltese. I, fi <laughs> I figured, I figured, yeah, I'm pretty good at reading people. <laughs> I'm not good at Italian accents, oh my days. People. <laughs> I can even tell that you're really gonna enjoy having me here. <laughs> I'm so embarrassed. <laughs> oh, Huck, come on, talk to me. Papa, this island is so great. What? Buongiorno is Italian, right? It's not French. Buongiorno. Buongiorno. But no, bonjour is French. Okay. What makes it so great? Oh, well, I'm glad uh, I ask myself. It's the fun and the sun and the weather and the wind, the local peaches and the swimming scene. It almost kind of make me think about moving here. You should live here, Huck. We need an Italian. Well, I'm honored. An exclusive invitation to an exclusive island for celebrities and entourages. There's just one little thing. I'd hate for it to be so exclusive that it's just me. Can you go check with, like, a VIP manager of whole island first? Just so I know this is legit. <laughs> <laughs> this is so not what Italians sound like, is it? <laughs> Leave it to me. Guten... Oh, we now he's German. Bonjour. Huck. I don't want you living here if you're going to be messing me about like that. Are you Italian? Or are you German? Decide. Because I have just put in the effort to make on your Italian. Guten Tag. <laughs> Guten Tag. Oh, Huck sounds more German than Italian. Why did he say bonjourno at the start? He's driving me nuts already and he's not even moved in. You're Italian now, Huck. <laughs> I don't even care. My Vader is in your hands, ha ha! <laughs> Have you talked to the executive producer about my role yet? I mean, about me moving here. Oh no, he's another patty! While you get the thing settled, I'll just wait here and visualize my new life. What do you know? Even in my visualizations, I am well dressed. I don't like him. Have you talked to the executive producer about my role yet? Oh, go away. No. He's not moving in. You stay. You don't move in. Please don't move in. Can I stop him moving in? Ah, oh, there's a pain in on my back. Backside. <laughs> I do not want him to move it in. We can find another Italian. It'll be fine. 
Yeah, we're not having Huck move in. Huck is not nice. I don't want Huck. Huck can go away. Chuck Huck out. No Huck. Oh wait, this isn't it. <gasps> Toy box! An art set. You a popcorn stand. I want all of this. Do I? I don't have money. <laughs> <laughs> That's so sad. I don't have the money. Yeah, let's have a look. <gasps> I love that. And I can't afford any of it. No. Oh well, it is what it is. No money is no buy. <laughs> oh well, it's fine. We're always outside anyway. Who needs a nice house? <laughs> okay, let's go see. Tom Nook. Please don't let Huck move in. I don't like him. I really don't like him. <laughs> Doing stretches, look at him. That's so cool. Let's have a look what's, oh actually I don't have money so there's no point looking in the store right now. I don't have the money. But we'll take the knock miles, thank you. Look at Isabel. Isabel, don't let Huck move in please. Let's talk to Tom Nook. Our campsite is impressive, and Isabel mentioned in today's broadcast. Today we have our first guest over at the campsite, Blanky. If you have time, or even if you don't have time, make time and go and check in on our guest. And if you get an opening, try talking to them into move. I did it. What? You already can? No, 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 no! We don't want her. No. Oh no! Oh no! I'm busy right now. Oh. I don't want him to move in. I don't want the annoying hawk to move in. No, 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 no. How do I tell him not to move in? He's really rude. Come on, let's kick him out. Isabel, help me. Discuss a resident. I feel really bad, but I don't like him. Yes, come on. Yes, I still need to. Oh, he doesn't even show up. Right, well, we're gonna build him a house and then we're gonna boot him out. No, I guess not. Oh, I don't like him. He's so annoying and he's, he's fake. That's why I don't like him. Cause he pretended to be Italian and then he pretended to be German. And I just, I don't know, who is he? What is he, you know? I just, I can't trust him. I can't trust him at all. Let's put him really far away. Let's build his house on the other side of the island so he can't get here. I know what we're gonna do. We'll build his house over, over here. We'll build it really high up so he's stuck on his own. Hey. <laughs> right, let's go up. Good, because I don't like him. He can stay away from everyone else till we boot him out and no one has to know. Let's see. Here, we'll put him up here. Yeah. <laughs> ha! Huck! This is what you get for being weird. Although it's quite a nice spot to be honest. But then I can kick him out, you see. No one has to get to know him. No, I need to rethink. That's not the right spot. I need to put it here. Let's have a look. Let's visualize it. Let me see. Let me imagine. Yeah. <laughs> He's stuck on his own. He can't get down. You stay there, Huck, you weirdo. We don't like you, really. It's a nice spot, anyway. And then you can stay all the way over there. All the way. Far, far, far. <laughs> far away from everyone else. <laughs> hey, Huck, I, I found you perfect place. Uh, he's uh, very far away, though. I hope you don't mind. You have uh, no choice. <laughs> let's go let's go talk to Huck oh Huck we have decided that you don't deserve to mingle with anyone else because you'll make everyone sad because you're so full of yourself and we already have oh, hello cat you're so so sleeping let's not wake him up oh actually I want to give you my rattan rattan wardrobe I've been kind of itchy lately it's super super annoying maybe something's on me itch eek he's got fleas oh I can catch him with a net let me catch this fleas with a net. Tissue. Rattan. Here, have this, and then I'm going to catch your fleas for you. Kit has fleas! Okay. 
Let me. Oh, he's giving me. He, wow, that's a lot of bells. I hope it was an expensive boy I just gave her. Right, cat, let's get the fleas off you. Oh. Oh, I need to go build it. Right, I'm gonna go build a thingy and then get the fleas off you. Ooh, I like that butterfly. Oh, I don't have a. Oh, well. Let's go get a thingy. And then we'll catch cats, fleas, and then we'll call it a day. Come on, let's go get a fleas. Oh, sorry, Eric. I nearly knocked your washing over. Come on, let's craft. We need to catch cats, please. Oh, wow, that's a lot of new stuff. Oh, I like that. I don't know what this is, though. It's a wooden fish. A wooden fish? What's a wooden fish? Oh, I like that. Oh, white mums. What's a white mum? Well, okay. Right, fish, not fish. <laughs> I don't know why I shout out the word fish. <laughs> Bug net. Let's go. Yep. I'm done. We just gotta go catch cats, please. We are going to help her with her itchiness. Come on. Come on, kitty cat. Oh, actually, shall we build a, a bridge as well while we're at it for the back side? Because the back side. <laughs> for the back bit of the island. Where was cat? Was she on this way? Oh, yeah, there's a really nice butterfly around here as well, wasn't there? Cat, cat, where are you? Where's cat gone? Oh, she's by the lighthouse. Look, you can see the fleas jumping off her. No. Nope. Sorry, don't want to. Oh, gross. Cat, you need to shower more, cat. <laughs> yes, I caught a flea. The curse is lifted. Having fleas is pretty bad, but on the bright side, now I'm not allergic to those rad clothes. What? Oh, that's true, I guess. Ooh. This. I'm gonna show you the lighthouse and then we'll build um, another flea flicker. <laughs> Hee -hee. Ew. Tidy wild child. Gross. Gross! Let's go have a look at my. There's the lighthouse. Look how cute it is. So nice. It's not on though. I don't know why. It's because it's not nighttime, maybe. Right, let's go ask to build a bridge because it doesn't matter anyway. Uh, oh, we need to talk to this dude, didn't we? talk to him. Let's see what he's saying. What's he saying? Hey, a hug. Ahoy. That's now he's trying to be pir a pirate. There's a little bit of local flavor for you. You got news for me or what? Seriously, you got me a personal red carpet and my own VIP cabana. That's hug for an invitation and my own place to live. Ah ha ha. <laughs> All right, now I really got to get back to my home island to get my things in order. Hasta la vista, Blanky. Hey, that fits really well. Hasta la vista, baby. Hasta la vista, Blanky. Cool. Go away. We're gonna kick you out. Don't be so happy. You're going. We don't want you. We don't want you at all. So don't don't smile at me like that. <laughs> don't give me that grin. I'm not happy with you. You tricked me. You pretended to be cool. And I would have been fine if you weren't cool. Just don't pretend to be cool. Be yourself. Don't pretend to be, goodness knows, Italian and French and German all in one go. You're not me. <laughs> you can't pretend to do that. Like I do with the accent. Oh, what was I doing? Why am I going this way? No, I need to get a bridge. I need to get a bridge from Tom Nook. Nooky, come here. Are you, where are you? I'm gonna go get him. I'm gonna get us a bridge and then all the lower level is like connected. Ah, Blakey, hello, hello. Well, did you find a place for us to build a new home? Of course. Oh, uh -huh. fine news, indeed. We don't want to keep our customer waiting, so I'll proceed with construction. We want our new island friends to start their lives here as quickly as possible. It's got me thinking we can't predict when someone will move here. But that scrambling secure plot only when the need arises is much too haphazard a way of doing business. Aha, uh -huh. yes, yes, of course. As part of improving infrastructure, we'll set aside plots in advance and put them up for sale. Yeah! I've had to charge a small processing fee, but if we get a buyer who moves in, I'll give you Wiles as a reward. Blanky, I do hope I can count on your help again. Yes, we'll do that in the next video though. Because we need to cook our cat. This is the construction consultation counter. How can I help you? Mm -hmm. Let's talk infrastructure. I want to build a bridge, please. I want to build a bridge. Yes. Um, I want a fancy one this time. I like this one. 
I like that one too. But I just, oh, I like that one too. It's very expensive though. What's that one though? It's 168. Um, let's build this one because I don't. Yeah, <laughs> it's expensive but not too expensive. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, let's build it, dude. It's so much money. It's so everything is so expensive in this game. I don't make enough bells. Right, where shall we put it? Let's go. Then we do it here. Oh, no, I want to do it in the beach because I get fed up when I'm trying to like cross things. And then... Oh, that's the house. So he is good. I think here's really good. Here's, here's the place. This is a spot. Let's see. Let me imagine it. That's a huge bridge. No, I don't like that. I think I want to go a little bit to the side, I think, a little bit. Try it here. No, not the same place. Okay. How about here? Let's see. Is it gonna look good? Yeah, that's good. Build. Oh, it's a massive bridge though. I don't know if I like the stone bridge. Should I have got the the other stone, the nice stone? Let's go for the nice stone. Oh, it's too late. I've Oh <laughs> no! What do I do? Can I change it? Can I? Can I re? Oh, it's too. Just, just build it. Just build it. It's fine. Yes. This is the spot. This is the spot. I think that's good. So Huck's gonna be moving in. We are gonna pick some more locations, and then we're gonna kick Huck out, put someone else in his house, cause yeah, <laughs> that's gonna happen. Cause I don't like. I don't like, um, yeah, I don't like Huck. Simple. I'm sorry. I don't like him. So, yeah, we'll do that in the next episode. Um, hopefully things will get built. And I will see you again very, very soon. Have a nice time and stay safe. And if you haven't already, please hit subscribe. And give this video a big thumbs up if you like it. Bye.